Hello, what is up guys and gals? This is Ali here. And welcome to a Resto Tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to build my um, button lock panel. Yeah, that's what I'm calling it. A button lock panel. It's kind of like a combination lock. But the difference between a combination lock and a lock panel is that the combination lock, you have to push the button in a certain order for it to... Uh, unlock the door for this one you just gotta like leave the right one on and leave the right one off if, if that that makes any sense and uh yeah it'd be that certain uh combination to uh unlock the door so uh yeah let me uh show you guys how it works all right so first off uh here's the uh, door that we're trying to open and these are the buttons and what you do is you push the buttons and it uh, turns on or off and you no know, if you push all of them they should all unlock the door what no way it's, it should open oh, oh oh okay yeah yeah that's the combination uh yeah so that's the combination for you go through come back out and then if any like any one of them is like wrong then uh then uh it locks the door so this one's wrong and then this one's right and the door still won't open so yeah all right well let me show you guys the uh red stones before we start building it and it's just like this it's really simple very easy and i'm pretty sure you guys could probably uh uh, build it from just looking at it from this angle but anyways uh yeah let's uh, get to the tutorial all right well what you uh, want to first do is look at your buttons so we're just gonna do uh, a few buttons and come around here and then put the uh, uh, rest on laps on top and then you'll want to put the buttons up front. So how many buttons we got here? Uh, nine. Okay, nine buttons. All right, now that you uh, got that done, uh, the uh, third block away from the uh, lamp lamps, you'll want to put a uh, dropper facing forward towards this way, towards the button, all the way across. And then in front of those uh, droppers, you'll want to put um, another line of droppers facing upwards just like this and above the uh, hoppers how many droppers that's facing uh, up you uh, make another one while well, you place them facing towards this way and then after all of this you take uh, some hoppers and you face them down into the uh, droppers below just like this yep and then you'll want to put a line of uh, of uh, comparators coming out of this hopper one dropper this side facing this way facing this way like this whoops okay and then in front of those uh, comparators you'll want another line of blocks going out towards this way and then put rest on torch on top of them just like this all right so uh now uh back here you'll want to put um uh repeaters facing out from the button block going into these uh droppers and then uh yeah that's basically it for the button so we're going to do the top part and uh what you want to do is you want to put a uh, blocks on top of these just like this and then you want to put um half slabs okay and then you'll want to put a half slab right uh where the uh, lamps are and then you'll want to put repeaters all the way across going into those blocks and then on top of the uh, hoppers as well 
whoops, not that way. And on top of the uh, choppers as well. And then on top of these uh, uh, resonal torch, you want to put a line of uh, blocks on top of it, above it. And in front of, well, yeah, in front of those blocks, put torches uh, right on top of them. Well, not on top, but in front of them. Just like this. And that will be your indicator. So whenever you push it, it will... Oh, yeah, that's right. We forgot to put an uh, item in each of these uh, uh, things. So uh, we'll take a whole line of items like this. And we'll just drop them into each one of them. So then, uh, since all of these are on, what well, that should work now. It should turn off and it should turn back on. Yeah, so now it's time to hook up the um, combination part. So, uh, whatever combination you want, whether it's on and off, and then on and then off, and then on and off, and on. So, if you want it something like this, I will make them OCD. Okay, well, if we want it something like this, well, imagine this is the on um, the on um, switch, or well, combination. What, what you want to do is you want to line up the, uh, crap. Okay, so what you want to do is you want to make your door, make sure it's, uh, on a, uh, on state so we just run the line through here and then uh, off of over here we'll put two two blocks coming out from this block and it doesn't really matter um, Okay, so if this is the um, combination you want, well, what you want to do is you want to hook up your door to it, and then make sure the door is on the uh, open uh, state. We'll run a, a rest on line to it. Okay, so if it's on an open state, then uh, then uh, we we'll have to make sure that this line of uh, redstone is actually off. So does that make sense? So in order for this to be uh, on, that has to be off. And then uh, well, we'll run um, two blocks away from this uh, no, from this uh block of uh, torches and then if it's uh, off then you put the torch in front of them like this and if it's on then you put the uh, rest on uh, the repeater coming out from it and that will uh, leave this rest on line off which will leave this uh, rest on torch on which will leave your door on open so if any one of these are wrong like, we'll, we'll do two of these like this one and this one okay so if any one of those are wrong you see how uh, the torches power the uh, rest on lines and the uh, repeater powers the rest on lines but well, that's uh, kind of how it uh, it um, works where it uh, turns on the line and and then this thing won't be able to turn on unless all of these are turned off, which is basically these two. 
Yeah, so that's my um button combination. No, not combination. My button lock panel. All right, guys. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the um, little rest on tutorial. I uh, actually liked it. I like the way it's set up and stuff. And now nah, I'm probably going to use it for future projects. But you know, anyways, that's all I have time for for today. So you guys be sure to hit that like button, subscribe. If not, comment on the thing and. Whatever you do, never stop watching. So you guys have a good day, and I'll catch you guys next time. Bye!